Vertical Line Test. What is a vertical line test? The vertical line test is a check to see if the graph of a relation is a function. Sometimes you'll see the vertical line test abbreviated as VLT. Question, what do you need to perform a vertical line test? First, you'll need to have a relation plotted or a graph visible on a coordinate plane in order to check using the test. If you have a table or a set of ordered pairs, that's okay, but these points need to be graphed before we can use the vertical line test. If you have a function already, such as y or f of x equals x cubed minus 4x squared plus 3x plus 6, you don't need to use the vertical line test to see if it's a function because you should know that each input value of x will have only one possible output value and therefore will not require a vertical line test to check, so therefore this will be a function. And you'll need to have an object with a straight edge that you can move over a coordinate plane. You can use a pencil, or you can use a ruler, or even the edge of a sheet of paper or anything with a straight edge. Here's the first relation we'll examine to see if it's a function. This line goes from left to right. So we take this time a ruler and starting from the left of the graph we orient the ruler vertically. And as we move this vertically oriented ruler from left to right, we ask the question, in how many places does this edge of the ruler touch the graph we're evaluating? We see that here, or in fact anywhere on the graph, that the edge of the ruler only touches the graph once, no matter where we go on the graph. Since the ruler edge touches the graph at most only once, this graph passes the vertical line test and is therefore a function. Now we'll look at this sideways parabola for which we'll use a pencil to check to perform a vertical line test. And moving from left to right, we see that the vertical line touches the graph at one point here at the left of the curve. And when we move the pencil farther to the right, as we've done here, we see that the edge of the pencil touches the graph at two different points. Therefore, the graph of this curve fails the vertical line test. And this graph is therefore not a function. Now we have these seven points plotted on a coordinate plane. We'll use our ruler this time and proceed from left to right. We go over to our first point on the left. We see that the ruler touches the graph of the plotted point once here. Check. As we move the ruler to the right to get to the next point, we see that the ruler touches the graph once at this next point. Check. We go to the next point to the right and see that the graph only touches the ruler once Again, check. And we move the ruler over to the next point and see that the ruler touches another point, a second point as well. The ruler touches twice and is therefore not a function. Two different outputs for the same input, not a function. Now we'll try another one. Actually, why don't you try this one? Is this graph a function? Stop the lesson and after you figure it out, restart the video to see how you did. Now we have the pencil and we see that no matter where we move this pencil, that it will never touch the graph more than once. So we say that this graph passes the vertical line test, or VLT for short, and is therefore a function. This has been Vertical Line Test. Thanks for viewing.